Well, there's a bee flying by. Hello, YouTube family. Vanjie Camp's coming at you. Tent got done really quickly, too. That's the entrance to the property. So people really can't see you, not that they care. So that's over there. That's the van, the other shelter. Everything that I'm trying to organize. Tent, dogs. So this took like 30 minutes. I'd say the one thing that I um, maybe should have paid a little more attention to would have been getting the center pole directly straight. It was like this slightly, but you have to lift it pretty good. And um, I'm strong, but I've met some strong women at the farm who are very strong. They could do that. I know that. But if you're not kind of like working like that all the time, it might be a little tricky. So it had a nice little bottom to it, round bottom piece stuck inside that little piece that you see right there sticks in and then you know once you've got all your d-rings in which the ones on the bottom green little fringe then you put that up then you put the other tie downs down it doesn't look i don't know i think it looks okay so this is just a well this is an entrance too but there's like two entrances i guess is this one i'm not gonna wear my boots inside but i did already i felt bad about it well, I'm going to go around the other way. So this op zip is there. So there's two sides. Front door, back door. Back door. But maybe front door. I don't know. Those zipper from the inside. Zipper from the outside to get ventilation. Tahoe gear. I don't know if I stake this down too well. Something. Iris. Philip. Sue. Yeah, it's about the same, I guess, so. I don't know. Maybe this will be the back door. The woods is right there. Nothing there. The jury is out. I'm not sure which way we'll go on that. So, let's zipper this. Doing this one-handed. Sometimes it gets stuck underneath the zipper, but with a light tug. I should say the zipper gets underneath the material, but with a light tug, it comes right up. I gotta use two hands. Hang on. No, I don't. Yes, I do. Ah! Edit. Edit. So, there it is. And I did come across a big root over there, which I was able to snap. And I walked around on my hands and knees all the way around. Hot in here, too. Not, well, warm. Nice. It's 70 degrees today outside. So we had a really nice day. Having a nice day. It's still early. I don't even think it's 10 o'clock. Might not even be 9. Um, so, yeah. I mean, that extra rope there must be for when the wind blows and it can pull up for that piece. That top little cap to let air out or let air cut through like those great gust buster umbrellas that i play a lot of golf used to and those things are the best because one, one layer could pass underneath and vent and then get sort of pushed out which is basically what's going on here so i'm liking the fact that it's warm because i bought a greenhouse thinking that i could live in the greenhouse partially and it was 10 by 10 by 7 and i'm like oh a greenhouse you know i can grow vegetables during the winter and stay inside but it was flimsy. It was still about the same price as this big fella here. Um, I'll keep this open to get a little air in there. Uh, yeah, so I'm really happy right now. Very, very happy. Um, Tahoe gear. They gave you everything. They gave you the, I had some few extra bigger ones. Oops. Love these, you know, whatever. And um, obviously I have to do a little bit better here. I'll make that all nice, but uh, Everything came included. The pole was just one of those ones that had the little kind of elastic between. Just snap, snap, snap. This bed side looks really bad, but we'll we'll get this all fixed and nice. Huge. I think it's 12 person, which would be tight. But man, for me and these two, I got a cot in there. Put that in there. This is going to work. I really feel great about this. So I'm happy with this purchase. It was a good eBay purchase. I, it was like under, I think it was like once. 165, 165 with shipping, maybe 175, but not 200. So this works out because that wasn't warm. I'm not saying I'm going to stay in here all the time, but I've seen these tent vents, which I'm not wanting to cut a hole, but like where you can put something in here, like a little stove, heating stove. I think you can cook off of them too, but I could just use the heating stove. I have a real awesome grill I want to unbox and show you guys the magma. So anyway, I'm talking more than I need to be talking right now. We're going to get this back over there. They had breakfast, they had their sardines. I have some other stuff to attend to, other building a business thing. So we'll see you guys. Thank you. Uh, Friday right now, I think the 7th of October. So wishing you and yours a very happy and enjoyable weekend. We all deserve it. And even if you don't, act like you do. Because, you know, these weekends are promised to no one. The world's going to hell, right? Okay, guys. Take care. Bye.